Hi, my name's Alison. Um, I'm from Adelaide and uh, I came along on this inner growth retreat because I love coming to Bali and um, I wanted to make some changes in my life. Um, and also I respected Peter's teachings and I thought he would be an inspiring person to do a workshop with. I came along on the retreat knowing that there'd be a breakthrough session and I was thinking, oh, I wonder what I'm gonna do, but it was really easy at the beginning to work out which area of life to do that in and the very first night <laughs> I had my first epiphany and then we released some emotions and there was more epiphanies um, and I just found that the I struggled with the meditation part because of the sitting because I'm not used to sitting cross-legged however the way that Peter's married together the meditation and the NLP is really a great it's really clever I think but it's so it's we might get stressed in the NLP processes but we release stuff and then the meditation just sort of helps to join it all together and and smooth it all out so yeah I've had a lot of really good realizations um, and I'm sure things are going to change in my life watch this space <laughs> <laughs> well it's a retreat so you you're in a place that's paradise it's beautiful it's relaxed all your cares are taken care of food and drinks are all provided included in the course and as I said the massages um, the accommodations are really good and then you've got the NLP um, it's it's I've always believed that NLP is a really powerful processes and techniques and really gentle they're not confrontational and as I said before, joining it with the meditation just helps to balance yourself out. And you know, but meditating in a beautiful place like Bali, um, I reckon I'm going to be recommending to all my friends that they come along here next year with me, um, or that they do something similar because it's very, very powerful but gentle and relaxing. Great. So I came to Villa Borea because I've been here before, I knew what it would be like and it's such a beautiful environment to do a retreat in. Uh, the food, I have reservations about Balinese food because it's often got chilli in it and I can't eat chilli. But the staff was really accommodating, they made me special dishes and a lot of the dishes didn't have chilli in so that was really good. Um, but that didn't seem to diminish other people because they could add more chilli on the side. Um, so the food was great, the accommodation is beautiful, um, the beds are comfortable, uh, yeah, so that aspect of it is very good. High standard, oh and the massages, I came also for the unlimited massages <laughs> and um, I have had a massage every day um, and that's helped me relax. Well, Peter's teaching, he's tough. With meditation he gives us all the advanced techniques and I don't need, didn't even know how to sit properly at the beginning however now I've got this really simple technique to sit and get centered and I've got lots of other techniques that when I get distracted by something over there another shiny bright object I can bring my attention back to the meditation so um, I struggled physically but Spiritually, I found that the techniques were really good and powerful and easy. The Kundalini Yoga with Marty. Marty is just a treasure. She is just the most, I love her. I really love her to bits. And she is so supportive in her, um, in when she's teaching her yoga. The people on the course, the oh, participants, yeah. the, the people that were with me. We started off on this journey. We didn't know where we were going. We didn't know each other. And we bonded really well through the excursions that we had to different places that helped through the ceremonies and the rituals that we did that helped and through the meditations as well um, it just everything helped us bond together as a really good group and i'm pretty sure most of us will stay friends forever